Hello, today I wanna to dive into Epidemic Sound's playlisting features. I wanna explain how it works, how you can best utilize them in multi-person work forms or just by yourself to organize your projects. Epidemic Sound has done a great job of streamlining this whole process in the past year, and I'm excited to kind of explain how it all works. Obviously, you're gonna start on your main home screen once you logged in, you've got all of your recommendations and things here. Where you wanna go for the playlisting is actually in the saved tab. This tab is where you're going to do your work and begin to start a project or a playlist. What's the difference between a project and a playlist? Well, let's start a new playlist or a project to explain it in the process. A project is, as it says right here, multiple playlists. You can put a bunch of playlists into one project and then have those all organized in the same spot. A playlist is just a single folder. It's sort of like a folder subfolder type system. So let's just start a project. Obviously this is going to be an imaginary project just to get an idea for it, but um, let's say I'm working on a short film that is going to be like a 19, 1970s road trip. Okay, 1970s road trip movie. That's simple enough. And right now we've got our empty project. There's no playlists in it. If you click on it right now, nothing is going to happen. It's not gonna open up because there's no playlists in it. So you wanna go to these little three dots over here, view more, and then hit new playlist. And from here, you can add a new playlist. Let's say this 70s movie is gonna have some pop music in it. So we'll make a playlist to organize that. And let's just add two more playlists, one for cinematic score and finally another playlist for sound effects so now we have a project playlist well playlists within the project where you can organize your different types of audio media that you're going to be using in your project whether that's a short film or even a youtube video now that we've created this project we can go into our browse features and start adding things to the project um, music that we think is going to go well with our video and this is going to completely vary depending upon your taste but since we're doing a 1970s movie I'll go to the 1970s pop section here and we've already got it all narrowed down so you like this song add it to the playlist and here we have right in your face recently updated so all of the ones that you're going to be working on and if you just create a project it's going to be right in your face right here we have sfx score and pop and those we know are in our folder for the 1970s road trip but you can also just go down to all just hit 1970s road trip and there you have the drop down menu with all of the different playlists in that project this is a pop song so we'll add it to the pop playlist and you'll see if we go back to saved and we go down here it is 70s road trip there's no tracks in sfx or in score but pop just had to refresh it's got the song that we added to it right in the playlist there so that's all pretty straightforward but one of the things that epidemic has done with their playlisting is they've made it really easy to collaborate with people in it and you'll see over here there's this little speech bubble and it's for adding notes so if I'm listening to the song and I say I really like from one minute to one minute 30 seconds, I can add a note like that. Now let's say I am an editor asking my director whether he likes the one minute to one minute 30 second portion of this song. I can just share the entire project or the playlist, but generally share the entire project with a director. And you just come out to this main screen, you hit add collaborators, and it'll put in email addresses that you can send out the project to. And you can share these projects with anybody. They don't need to be paying for an Epidemic Sound subscription. All they need to do is click on a little link. I'll show you how it works. And I'm going to send this project to an email account that I don't have a subscription or even an account on Epidemic Sound. And I've logged into my email that I sent that invitation to, and you can see it's right here. Just hit accept invitation and it will pull up the login screen for Epidemic Sound. So let's just say your director doesn't have an Epidemic Sound account. We'll create a new account under the email I sent it to. And here we are, logged in, just created a new account, and right off the bat, invitation to project, you've been invited to collaborate on the project 70s Road Trip. All you have to do is hit join project, 
And even though I'm not paying for a subscription or anything like that on this account, I have access to this song. I have access to this note that the person sent over. And I can go through and add comments myself. Let's just say, yes, I like it. Boom. And this is going to be completely synced for the editor. So if I go back and I log out of this account, log back into my main account, and I hit my saved, go to the 70s road trip, hit pop, view notes, boom. It's right there. The director's comment, yes, I like it. Just like that. It's really an incredible system for working with other people on projects because things happen practically in real time and it allows a lot of workflow. I could even be on a phone call with the director and be talking about these things and he can go through and listen to the songs that I add to the playlist as I'm adding them to the playlist. This is by far the most advanced playlisting collaborative system that I've seen on a royalty free sound service like this. So I'm really impressed by Epidemic Sound and I hope that more services are going to start implementing things like this. But for now, Epidemic is the way to go if you're trying to work with a group of people at least in my opinion. Let me know what you think in the comments below. If you have any questions, you can also leave them down there. I'll get back to you lickety split. I hope you have an amazing day. You remember you're an awesome human being and you keep on creating. Peace.